about to be decorating my home for Christmas, which is so fun. I look forward to it every year, but I wanted to stop and just quickly introduce for you guys. I don't think I've ever done a proper introduction of my cat lady. She is an adult ragdoll female and she's right here and it's kind of quiet time so she's really quiet and calm she's my baby and i've had her over a year now but um on top of that we have a new member of the family as of about a week ago and her name is chloe it's been such a sweet journey adding her into our family and helping her get comfortable and adjusted and for our lady to get adjusted but also just this is a huge really sweet moment that my cats are both on the cat tree so i just wanted to introduce you properly to my two kitties again the adult one is lady here on the left and my new kitten is chloe on the right so excited to be a cat mom of two now and i will have a full video for you guys showing the journey of bringing chloe home and um, updates about how it went integrating her into our home so now time for me to get to christmas decorating hope y'all are having a great day hey guys so it's time to finally decorate my home for christmas and also take down the fall decor so let's get into it i'm so excited it's gonna be so much fun it's my favorite time of the year i just got these um this like fall little leafy garland this year from Target, which is the best. I love finding things there for holiday decor and other stuff too, like everything. Um, so I'm gonna try to preserve them the best I can by putting them in a trash bag and hope that they all stay attached until next year. And I have some garland, which is also from Target, but I got this last year. So I kept like the original kind of cardboard that held it all wrapped around so that I could store it that way and so now it's time to bring it back out again. I'm realizing last year I had like this huge set of bay windows that were just all connected so I just had this one long garland but this year I've got two windows that are separated so I'm gonna have to cut the garland which is fine I just gotta get this right. <laughs> So I was starting to hang my garland and I was using my push pins because I have so many. I was like, let's just do that. Well, it wasn't going to work. Um, they're not strong enough. So I gave in and I went and bought some command hooks. So they are on the wall, just getting firmly stuck on, on the wall. And while they finish drying, um, I'm going to clean my couch and put out my Christmas pillows. So let's do it. <laughs> to decorate my garland and finally put it up around the windows so I actually found this spool of ribbon at oh but a baby paper bless you I found this spool of uh, ribbon it has four different colors they're all glitter and glitter is like one of my favorite things um, that's always a winner for me if it's got glitter I'm gonna love it <laughs> baby, oh, bless you. Chloe's had some allergies since she got here to our home and I've talked to our vet a couple times. She just says that can happen when you first bring a kitten home. So I'm keeping an eye on her. It's hard not to just wanna rush her to the doctor, but they're like, you know, they know what they're talking about. We've spoken on the phone about it. And I'm just, you know, if I really get more concerned, she and I may go to the doctor. It's really hard to hear your baby sick. I'm sure parents of humans feel that way all the time. And if, I'm sure fur baby parents feel it too. Anywho, we're gonna try to keep this 
Christmas spirit going and make that hopefully will make my baby feel better. So <laughs> I have four different color ribbons here. I think maybe two are gold, one is silver, one is pink. Possibly that's right. But I don't know which is which, right? So I'm gonna use my favorite app for help called Be My Eyes to find out. I'm just calling a volunteer right now, waiting for someone to answer. So I can get to ribbon decorating. Hello. Hi, how are you? Good, thanks. My name's Ashley, how are you? I'm doing well, how can I help? Um, I have here a spool with four different color ribbons on it. Do you see it? I do. So, can you tell me the four colors? Uh, the first one on the right side looks like a silver. Mm -hmm. Then it goes to a goldish, then kind of a rose pink, mm -hmm. and then a looks like a, a brighter shade of gold. I can't really tell the difference between the second and the fourth. Got it. Okay. Well, thank you so much for your help. No problem. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. Bye bye. Now, gotta start getting this out so I can make my garland really shine. Hey guys, so as you may have noticed, um, one of my little hooks kind of came off. Not kind of, it just popped off the wall. It's an older one, like I had a few smaller hooks already on there from my fall decor, but they were like kind of too small for this garland, but it, I don't know, it's hard to explain, but like sometimes they can work and sometimes not. But um, so that one popped off, I need to get another hook that had also popped off and put some new adhesive in try to get it to stick on the wall. So let's jump on this. <laughs> Trial and error. <laughs> So I think that hook I just added back on the wall should be like firmly adhered. So now I can fix my garland. So let's get that footstool. This is a cute little gingerbread house my mom gave me last year, I think. It's obviously lighting up, which is so cute. And really, I love that element because it reminds me of those cute little snow villages people put in their homes. Um, my aunt actually has one she puts up, and I used to love it. Like, ever since I was a little kid, she's always had it in her home at Christmas. And... Um, so yeah, my mom gave this to me, I think last year and I love, especially that it's glitter as well. So just an extra sweet little touch. And this little nutcracker was a gift, I think from my grandma last year, maybe. Um, I'm usually better at recall with like who gifts are from and exactly when I got them. But, um, I think maybe it's gotten more challenging since I lost my vision. Maybe that's fair <laughs> to expect. But yeah, um, it's my first little nutcracker. I used to gift them to my mom, like the full size ones. Um, growing up, like that was what I gifted her for several years in a row. So she has a really awesome collection. And he is my first one. So I'm excited to have him here. So these are working. I'm so happy I had them last year and I forgot they're like that warmer white color. Like some, you know, can be a super bright white, which is I guess probably nice for like if you're using them outdoors on your lawn and like the brighter the better. But um, for me, I like this kind of warmer white light indoors. It's just cozy and it's perfect and I'm excited. Um, I'm visually impaired, but I have light perception. so. Sources of light just make me feel more comfortable and just kind of provide a sense of 
comfort it's redundant i guess but it just it's true that is it i think for now like i i don't have any other decorations that i know of i wanted to put twinkle lights on my garlands but like either i'm missing one or i don't know i just don't have enough and so i might go end up getting more eventually but i'm also like i feel like i've been making so many trips to stores lately because it's holiday season and christmas shopping and everything but tbd because i love twinkle lights <laughs> <laughs> but for now this kind of concludes my holiday decor um it was so fun um thank you so much for decorating with me um i had so much fun bringing out the old pieces from last year and adding some new things like the ribbons and um my some of my pillows and my red blanket with the christmas trees on it like it was so fun decorating with you guys i hope you had fun with me <laughs> and i hope you enjoy decorating your home as well and really get in the spirit of the season. Um, I think this calls for a Christmas movie night. What do you think? <laughs> um, if you feel like it, comment down below what's your favorite holiday movie. There's so many good ones, but I have not seen all of them. So I'd love to hear your favorite. And again, thanks for decorating with me and for watching this video. And I'll see you next time.